friends, I'm Pastor Eun Seo. I'm so excited to have this time with y'all. Oh, wait, did you say hello? Okay, how about this? Can you give me your gentlest hello? On the count of three, let's say it as softly as we can. Are you ready? Okay, one, two, three. Hello. Great. Okay, so today we're gonna talk about something special, as soft as a puppy and as tender as a hug. It is gentleness. Gentleness is a beautiful fruit of the spirit, which means it is something that grows in our hearts when we follow Jesus. So let me tell this story. Let us imagine that you are holding a tiny and little bird in your hands. How would you hold it? Would you squeeze it tight? No, you don't want it. You would hold it gently. And um, because we, you don't want to hurt it and you don't want to scare it, right? That is gentleness. It is being careful with our words and with our actions so that we don't hurt any others. Now think about when someone is very upset, probably your friends or your sisters or your brothers. If we speak to them with loud and harsh words, will that make them feel better? No, it will not. But if we use gentle words, that will make them feel better and make them feel loved. That is gentleness. So we can be gentle by using kind words and by touching things carefully and by treating others the way we want to be treated with kindness and with love. In the Bible, it says gentleness is a fruit of the spirit. That means when we ask Jesus to help us to be gentle, he helps us to be gentle, just like him. Well, even though Jesus had all the power in the universe, he never used the power to be mean or rush. Instead, he was loving and he was kind and he was gentle. So let us remember every day we can ask Jesus to help us to be gentle just in everything we do. And every day is a new opportunity to practice gentleness. So are you ready to practice gentleness to your friends and your family? Okay, great. Let us ask God through our prayer. Dear God, thank you for teaching us about gentleness. Thank you for giving us the fruit of gentleness. Help us to be gentle like Jesus in our words, in our actions, and in our hearts. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.